Well, it's come to that time <laughs> since I'm moving into my bedroom that once again I'm in desperate need of a dresser for my clothing. So this is what I bought online uh, at the online auction. Uh, I can't say I got a great deal on it. It's in pretty rough shape, so that was a bit disappointing. You'll be able to see here there's stains and uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's very grand. I have to give it that. Um, and it will be good. The, the drawers are nice and deep and that kind of thing. So, but yeah, it's just, you know, it's like stuff like that. Like it's be hammered back. So, um, anyway, I'm going to try and do what I did to that guy, which is still sitting here. Um, this is the problem when you're on your own. In a chateau, you have to wait for people to show up that will um, be willing to help you carry things, like heavy things upstairs. Anyway, uh, so I'm going to try and make this clean and pretty and we'll go from there. So here comes the time lapse. <laughs> Well, you certainly get what you pay for, <laughs> uh, and sometimes not even that. This is in really rough shape, and I'm really disappointed, but anyway, making the best of it. Um, it was inside the drawers that I began to realize how bad it was. Um, some of these have been attached by modern day screws instead of the little, the little nails. And inside the drawer, <laughs> They go right on through. So if you can see here. So yeah, these are little nail, like the, the heads are sticking out. You can see even worse there. So I guess I clip those off. I don't even know what to do about those. Um, and the finish is better, but it's pretty modely. I don't know, maybe they'll get better as they dry. We'll see. Uh, yeah, it's such a shame because I saw one at another brocante that was like basically the same price and it was in pristine condition. So I'm really regretting having done this one. You know, the problem with the auction is uh, it's almost it's almost criminal. Like they don't all they show is a teeny weeny little picture and uh, they don't disclose any of the damage. So it feels really unfair. Unfair to me that they don't do that for people who are buying online. So buyer beware. That's, uh, that's the reality of buying on an online auction. <laughs> There's my warning for you. <laughs> the tamping begins. Tilted. 
Okay, we got a few more steps closer today. Yay, it's all here, I moved in, and now I finally have a place to put my clothing. Oh my goodness, how fun will this be? And I believe that they put the marble back. <gasps> look, oh my gosh, look, 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 you guys. Wow, they're gonna come back and put the plumbing in tomorrow. Oh my gosh, I love it. How cute is that? How fun. So right now it's touching the marble. So I think somehow it's gotten a little off kilter. So we're gonna have to figure that out. Um, hmm. Yep, this is a moment where I need you, Bruce. <laughs> where are you? <laughs> come back. <laughs> Come back, come back. And then uh, this is where Wanda has done her magic. So put the doors on after the plumbing goes in. So super exciting. And then there's another piece that goes over the top there. And uh, then we'll be, we'll be in business. Oh my gosh, getting so close. Still have to hang this, the, the circle that's gonna hold the shower curtain. But before I do any of that, I've got to sand all this down and paint it. So <laughs> as fun as this is, there's still a lot of work to do. All right, we have Simon going up in this tree to cut down some of the uh, larger dead branches. He uh, apparently tried to put his rope in, on a branch and discovered that it was dead. So <laughs> he's having to rearrange. Gonna start in five minutes. Okay, I think he's ready. Okay. On y va. That is uh, <laughs> the part, difficult part. Yes, tying the knots. <laughs> 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 well, they're all going to get cut, uh, crushed yeah. with the uh, falling uh, branches, won't they? This is where I would wind up in a tangled mess. That looks exhausting. <laughs> huh? It looks very tiring. Are you tired? Yes, it, uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I make it just one. Yes. <laughs> and I stay up. <laughs> and then you stay up there. Yeah. Simon's determined to have lunch in the tree. Okay, he's made it. Into the tree. Okay. Oh, that is. Oh my goodness, he's so high up. Okay, remember the lost goldfish from the kind of little river that's in that cave over there? Well, came out the other day with the mason and look who I found. And he's like triple the size. Isn't this crazy? There's only one that I've seen. It's just this orange and white one. But he's alive. He is alive. I'm just so shocked. He is obviously faring very well and getting lots to eat. And honestly, so far this year, even though it's been a really wet kind of spring and early summer, uh, not nearly as many mosquitoes as, as normal. Maybe it's all up to him. It's all because of him. Oh, my God. 
Bravo! <laughs> oh, la la. <laughs> oh, wow, this is great. Perfect. We are trying to get this uh, <laughs> kind of under control, this cave. Oh, we. Wow. I think Cafarnaum is a word. What does it mean? Cafarnaum is a, a mess, like a big cave mess. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, then that's perfect. Like that when you go to a brocante and uh, something like this, you have everything. Oh, yeah, there. yeah. You can find what you want <laughs> if you look. Uh, that's cool. That, so those were already there. Yeah, this the one. Shelves. I mean, that's oh. this. But the shelves. But the wood was just this. Too short, oh. so that's why I had to cut and make a junction here. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Ah, uh, these are gonna be good. Yeah, yeah. this will be really good. Yeah, we're gonna have more space. Yeah. And hopefully, if we keep everything in plastic, we'll yeah. keep everything dry. Great, great. Always a sunny side across the river Take a ride, take a swim and all your worries go away Go cross the river and you'll be fine Go counting winners, it's right down the line You'll be alright from sunny side seems unperturbed by the work that's going on. <laughs> oh dear, so silly. All right, well, slowly coming off and uh, I've just got this wall to do, but then I have to do up above once I've got the, uh, the scaffolding thing, which uh, hopefully Tamal will bring tomorrow, if he doesn't forget. So uh, I can finish doing the rest of the room. He just went out to look at the chimney and sure enough, it needs a full repointing. It's in bad shape. Surprise, surprise, woo -hoo. So now we gotta figure out a solution to that. Ongoing, ongoing. All right, I'm gonna carry on. Okay, we're just uh, trying to find the height for our sign. We've decided it's too high right now, so it's gonna take down a little bit. Maybe 10. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like that's better. Well, it's mosquito we hear. Yeah. <laughs> it. I'm I lost one liter. One liter of blood. <laughs> The pillar is not straight, so we either, yeah, so. <laughs> it's not quite, we can't quite make it center. Either the, the whole sign will look crooked or the pillar will look crooked. I think it's better to make the pillar look crooked, crooked yeah. Yeah. So since this, it already is. So the sign there for you, like this, it's okay? Yeah, I think that's a good height, I think. Gosh, I don't know. I've never hung a sign for a chateau in my life before. I have no idea what's the right height. Yeah. Yeah. Pillar. 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 Pillier. Pillier, okay. <laughs> Pillier it is. <laughs> That's much prettier. Okay, the moment of truth. Oh, 
sorry. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> oh, I see. It looks amazing. There it is. You can't tell in the video, but it's green, not black. It looks black in the video. It's funny. I'm just laughing. It's official. It's, it's now a chateau. It doesn't matter what other people say. I know it's only a Maison de Myth, but <laughs> now it's officially a chateau. <laughs> We have a lot of wood down. Oh my gosh, where is he? I cannot see him at all. Follow the rope. Oh, there he is. Way up there. Gosh, he's so high. Uh, oh, that's so terrifying to me. Okay, here we are. Oh wow, this is great. Very much a work in progress. Okay. Welcome to Earth. <laughs> Welcome to Earth. <laughs> Welcome back, man. So I'm sitting here having my uh, my breakfast this morning, and I wish I could. <laughs> smell o vision the smell to you because it's uh you know this is a cedar so it smells like cedar but i've been sitting here fascinated because just overnight i don't know if you can see but these branches are now covered in spider webs that are like glistening in the sun it's amazing how fast nature takes over <laughs> so there you go morning thoughts it was a busy night, apparently. Okay, Simon's making short work. <laughs> All of this. I have a lot of firewood. Who is that in the tub trying to unscrew the marble and take <laughs> it all apart? Could it be Tama? Could it be that the new faucets that we have don't fit because the marble is too thick right here and that we're going to have to sand behind the back of it? So now we have to take it all apart all over again. Can you give me the box with the difference? Mm -hmm. Thank you. So this is what happens when you buy something really old and think it's really cool and try to add something new to it. It's not standard. <laughs> I'm the queen of this. Here we are. <laughs> Sorry, Tama. It's okay. <laughs> it's life. <laughs> okay, Tama has finished with the tamping. The machine finally came back. Convicted it. Oh, my sable coop. Um, <laughs> so now it's all ready for what's the next layer? Put the lime. No, the lime, lime, the show? Show, the show. The dal de show. Okay. 15 centimeters dal de show. 15 centimeters, wow. But I think I'm gonna. Um, here you see it's uh, all wet. On yeah. The one. So I want to. I will not put the dal. Okay, on you'll the put wall. the I'll make uh, like. Um, put a wood straight. Uh huh. Make the, the dal inside here on okay. the left and on the right I keep the uh, space. Okay. And the water can go through. Yes. So with gravel or something. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Because yeah, there is a very, very lot of water. Right. Okay. Excellent. All right. Tima has created a groove. We should do it downstairs. We should have done it downstairs. Yeah, I didn't know. I didn't know it was so... So bad. Yeah. So many just... I thought it was white, but no. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So we're sanding the edges so that we can So that the sink will fit back far enough so that the sink that goes in the middle over here will fit properly and tilt properly. So that's where we're at right now. Now, hopefully that's the last sand. So that's why I need the bumper on the front. Okay, the first test. Is it too low? I do my toilet. <laughs> so you, you keep, you don't, you keep the water. The water stays. Uh, so you clean yourself with the dirty water. <laughs> <laughs> and then voila, down it goes. Awesome. All right, well, I think uh, just a little bit bigger of a bumper so that the sink yeah. doesn't fall down there. And I think we nailed it. It's a little low, the tap, but I think it's all right. But for this, you need to have something. Uh... Oh, maybe I can put something here. Oh, maybe, yeah, uh, yeah. Oops. And for those of you who don't know, this is where razor blades go, used razor blades. Two more bumpers on the front of this thing. So. Bueno. Almost. Yep. Better. Better. Not perfect, but mm -hmm. what it takes like is. No? Yep. Very cool. This is not going to crack it. Well, there you go, folks. We work for at least uh, one year. <laughs> okay. Well, all the tree, all the wood <laughs> from the fallen tree is all here. They've cut it up, and I've got kindling to last me forever. <laughs> so that's awesome. Wow. And it smells so nice. It's just so cedary. Cedary in here now. <laughs> this is funny. And thus it begins. Wow. All right. We're starting to clear the uh, top of the cliff. <laughs> and we've cleared that little spot. And this is the result. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Holy cow. Well, it'll be good to get it done. Although it looks so pretty as it is now, so I'm kind of of two minds. <laughs> I love how it's all grown over, but unfortunately it's not good for the cliff and the stability, so I hope. Okay, it's official. I have my titre de sojour, and I'm good for four years. Yeehaw! It's almost like I'm a, I'm a real person now. <laughs> Anyhow, don't laugh at my photo. It's bad. It's really bad. Okay, another step. It feels like a big one. <laughs> Exciting. I'm allowed to stay for four years. What? I'm allowed to stay for four, four years. years. Yeah, that's real cool. Yep. <laughs> hey. Wow. Looking good. Yes. Well, that's a huge difference. Eh? 
Un grand changement. Un grand changement, oui. That looks kind of fun. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, this is the first time I've been up here since they've cut the trees down. So this is the original crevasse that was here already. And this is the one that was created by the fall. And this is where they cut all the trees down. So now we have quite, well, it's gonna be a terrace. This will be the new edge of the cliff. <laughs> but how about that view? Holy cow, isn't that crazy? So basically everything on this side is going to fall down. Brum, 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 all that. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'm being told they're coming <laughs> by the end of July. And I hope they do because that means if they don't, it will be September, October before they actually come, which is not ideal, but there is no ideal time. So I guess it really doesn't matter, but I just want to get it done and then start cleaning it up. Wow, look at this. This is so crazy. So crazy. So much rock is going to be gone. There you go. There's the big tree that Simon, Simon trimmed up yesterday, or two days ago. And there's my sunflower field. Oh, and there's a big bee. And, uh, yeah. So... This is grass. You can see why it's obvious that it's going to go at any moment. <laughs> the only thing that old, holding it is like roots. Oh, crazy, crazy. Anyway, they've um, they basically cut all the way along here. Um, all these, uh, you know, they're basically, I don't know what they're called, privets or laurels. So they've cut them all down. So it'll be kind of nice. We'll be able to have a view as you walk along here now. And um, I think if we keep that, it will uh, form, a, form a sort of wall. Because um, I don't know how much behind this wall is going to fall, if any. So that's going to be the next question. Gosh, the uh, cicadas are really loud these days. All right, well, I'm just kind of doing a tour up here. I'm sure these people are going to be happy. They've got more of a view themselves for their houses, too. <laughs> Added benefits. Although I suppose there's enough trees here blocking their view. Ooh, la la. An obstacle course here. So this is where, oh, maybe a little further along. Oh yeah, this is where <laughs> Simon's tethered right now. <laughs> so he's cutting all the, all that ivy down off the end. All this ivy. No, that's not ivy. That's a privet. I don't know. This is the chimney for the bakery. You can see through there. And this is the wall that they've been clearing down here. So that's the sort of the stone wall next to the chimney. I wish they, I wish there was a stone wall on this side of the chimney, but there is not, alas. So it's all much clearer. You can definitely see the house now walking along here, which you couldn't really do before. Oh, it's a long way down. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of heights. Mm. Ah, ah. Got my hair stuck in a twig. Oh, ow. Let go. There we go. Oh. Now it's in my hair. Ow. Okay. All right. Well, that's the tour. The tour of the cliff. <laughs> All right. This vine is proving to be pretty difficult to get off. It's a nasty one.
part of me that just wants him to hang, <laughs> hang. I have this idea that he's gonna hang on a chunk of it and so I'm just gonna pull it all down off the wall. But I guess that's not the reality. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe that's what he's working towards. Looks like he's got a good chunk of it off now. Alright, well, we got him a little better of a tool, so maybe that will help move things along a little, a little faster. It's just miserable stuff to get off. Down at the bottom, the trunks are like the size of my arms. All right, now it's really starting to come. Nothing like having the right tool. Weed whacking the cliff. So, but it's looking a lot better. There's still this monster to get rid of. Yep. I'm guessing he's trying to make his way over there. Aha. Oops. I didn't see uh, Seymour right here. There we go. Oh, wow. That is so satisfying. <laughs> Wow. All I can smell is the mint. <laughs> All the stuff is dropping onto. Oh, sorry, I think you rosier. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, and my hydrangea. Oh, dear. We'll try and rescue them. Yeah, I can. Gonna see the roof of the little hut. Je descends ou remonte? Je descends ou remonte? C'est quoi le mot? Je remonte pour prendre. 
Well, there it is exposed. Look at that roof. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. And look at my garden. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> I've done the lower part of this whole room, so it's all been stripped and sponged down, and so all of these walls are ready to go and be plastered. But now I have to get the uh, the scaffolding thing so I can do the top part because <laughs> I couldn't reach some of the wallpaper. So anyhow, I'm gonna have both this room and the other room kind of all ready to go and be painted. So the plaster is just taking care of Rossignol. That's what he's doing today. I think he's gonna come back next week and finish this room. Although I'm struggling to understand his French, so. <laughs> um, but I think that's what's happening. And then he is finishing the bathroom, the plastering in the bathroom. So uh, next week, it's looking like lots of painting is coming my way. I'm gonna have to prime all the, all the plaster with primer paint. And then I'm gonna have to figure out what color to paint every, paint these two rooms. <laughs> so I'm sure you guys have lots of ideas. Um, this room is the one that has the mustard colored bed, so I'm kind of going with that. The other bedroom has sort of the blue velvet bed, so I'm kind of going on the bed, the bed color to try and figure it out. So I'm thinking that Rosanelle will have a kind of light blue color. And this room, I'm not really sure. I'm almost feeling like a kind of a purpley gray, but really pale, but I don't want it to look like mauve, so hmm. Um, that's where I'm at. There we go. You don't do it well, you don't the corner, it's not perfect. I know, it's weird. But I don't feel like arguing with him anymore. Yeah? I don't feel like arguing with him anymore. Oh, oh la la! Oh my gosh. Wow. Ça va, Pierre? Ouais, ouais. Tu t'es fait exprès? Oui, oui. Ok. Elle était complètement fouillée. Ouais, ouais. That's what I would wind up doing. I'd wind up macheting the rope <laughs> and dying, <laughs> plummeting to my death. Wow, look at that. Woo! Go in grot? Find a grot and find a cave inside. Oh, really? Tu peux rentrer dedans? Non. Ah, pourtant t'es petit, toi. <laughs> Too small for him. There's no gold. Regarde s'il y a pas des pièces d'or cachées dedans. Mets la main dedans. Put your hand in. That's a scary thing to do. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Right. It's the roots, man. Yeah. What do you know from the roots? This is just a huge mat of roots.
Wow. It's like a, a layer of cement, a carpet of cement, of root, rooted cement. Oh, he found a, a bird's nest. Oh, look. Yeah, I find a set of under. No birds in it. No. That's good. Well, it's pretty impressive. A lot, a lot of stuff has come down. All right, I'm at a brocante in the rain. <laughs> I'm good for my weather vanes at the moment. <laughs> Statue. It's so cool doors. He's got the train, too. look at this little teeny weeny bathtub. <laughs> wow. The little chair next to it. Yeah. So cute. Hmm. Didn't we sell this? Yeah, we did it. 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 Got the, the shabby chic booth, although I kind of love these prints. <laughs> oh, oh, he's adorable. Hi, he looks just like Chloe. Hi. Oh, you smell Chloe. Huh? Lynette. Hi, Lynette. Hi. Oh. That's cool. Aspirator. <laughs> 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 How do we like this chair? It's pretty cool. Must have been made out of an old bed or something. Old crib? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> This old medical, uh, yeah. must have been for nice. medical utensils. The dentist. <laughs> I'm gonna go look at the brass because I'm looking for a handle for my uh, my sink in my bathroom. It's uh, missing a little, you know, like a ring. Oh, I like the color of that, of those chairs. It's a pretty color of those chairs. I love the color of the velvet. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I wish I'd taken a picture of it. We do that all the time. Right? Yeah.
it's kind of like this, but it has a ring, you know, it's yeah. got a ring to it. Or better yet, Vince will say, Oh, yeah, you need to remember to get this. And, and I'll say, Oh, yeah, what were the measurements? I measured it. I sent that to you in, in a text four months ago. Right. Uh, Yeah, there's all the uh, the pieces to chandeliers. It's 400 euros for that for that piece of art. <laughs> oh boy.